and I welcome you to the vlog. It is sure nice to see you here. Your presence here is a lot warmer than the weather right now. It's windy, it's cold, and it's raining, and it's messing up my travel plans. Thought of uh, going and showing you around a little bit here. There's some really nice things in the area. But you can't change what you can't change, right? It's all about perspective. So um, the sun is looks like it wants to come out um, so I'm happy about that I'm happy to be able to, to talk to you today if you're new to my channel this is a space for anybody who is looking to reinvent their life and that is a big thing that, that is uh, it involves so many different things and so many I don't know what it involves. <laughs> See, it's all about trying to figure it out. It's about discovering who you are in the world and who you are in God and who you need to be knowing those two things. So we'll be talking more about, about some, uh, many of those subjects. take to reinvent our life in my experience I've come to find out that it's it's a question of not only changing watch this it's a matter of a change of nature so I heard the story about a dog named Molly Molly was a great dog, she was obedient when she would go for walks, she would chase squirrels, but when she would be left alone, she'd go nuts, she'd drink out of the toilet and then immediately lick the plates and then she would go after the remote control and tear up the shoes. And the dog's owner is talking about how he would like to put a little bit of, of human intellect into this dog's mind, if that were possible. And that got me thinking, that is exactly how we change our nature. We put a little bit of outside perspective into our thinking. Even though an outside perspective is a great way to change your outlook on things, it's not a surefire way because, well, let's be honest, people fail people, right? You may be inspired to change, but you don't know how far you will go because changing your nature is something completely out of the ordinary. You might be able to foresee things that are coming because of your natural responses, but there's no way you can change it because you're not the master of your of your nature. See, human nature is really fickle. Think about a person who is not a regular human, like a super athlete, right? How long would it take for him to fall back into a regular lifestyle if he wanted to, if he allowed himself to? I'd say pretty fast. All it would take for him is to quit his routine and start watching TV and start eating fast food and in six months to a year, he's no different than, than uh, anybody else. Let me break this down for you. We can try, we can do, we can achieve and achieving is not the end of it. We can succeed further and we can keep going. But if it's all done in our own strength, then it is always a liability because it always hinges on, on our effort. The day that we stop is the day it all crashes down. That's why we gotta change something that is deeper than perspective, that is deeper than our effort and our abilities. We gotta go for the root of our nature. And we gotta go to the one that created our nature. 